With soaring energy costs, increasing demand, fossil fuel pollution, and the effects of climate change, sustainable energy is a critical issue at the upcoming Rio Plus 20 UN Conference on Sustainable Development. We already have a certain energy system in place and it takes a lot of political commitment and will and imagination and investment in the alternatives to shift the balance towards something that's clean and, and safe and for the future. And that requires very strong tools, strong incentives. We have to get rid of fossil fuel subsidies, for instance, and we have to put in place the kinds of subsidies and support that can actually shift the balance towards the clean and safe and sustainable sources that we need for the future. Energy consumption is the single largest contributor of greenhouse gases accounting for 60% of emissions globally. With one in five people still lacking access to modern electricity, demand for energy worldwide will continue to grow. We are quickly running up against planetary boundaries when it comes to how we use energy. We keep uh, drilling in more and more difficult and costly places, and we still can't keep up with uh, demand. Three billion people use wood, coal, charcoal or animal waste as fuel for cooking and heating. These emit toxins that cause the death of nearly 2 million people every year. 1.7 billion people have no access to electricity. 2.7 billion still rely on traditional means for cooking and, and heating. We need to come up with a different way of producing and consuming energy. It's critical for sustainable development. If we all work hard and we put our heads together and, uh, and, and try to focus on solutions, it's amazing what people, it's amazing what governments, it's amazing what the private sector can do.